Hey guys, well, I'm going to make a video that I usually wouldn't make a video on, but it's quite important, and it could help a lot of people. So, quite a lot of you know about Operation Pridefall. Now, I want to talk about that today. So what it is, is a bunch of people against LGBTQ, and they will go and harass anyone LGBTQ, and post homophobic content that will scare a lot of you, and make them and make you join them. So, I want to talk about what they're trying to do, when it starts, and what you can do to protect yourself. So, most of the damage is going to be done on Twitter, which is good if you don't have Twitter. But then there's going to be quite a lot of damage also done on Discord and YouTube. So, the operation starts on June 1st, so you should probably start protecting yourself by June 1st. So what I would recommend doing if you have post, if you post any content on YouTube that's LGBTQ, if you don't want to get harassed, well they harass people, that's what they do. And I've heard that they might be kidnapping, raping, and murdering anyone LGBTQ. Now what I think you should be doing is on YouTube, if lots of people on YouTube know that you're not straight. I think you should do is turn on incognito. Oh, I can't. I can't say that. Turn on incognito so n they can't see you. No one can see you. And then in your bios, in anything, if you say that you're pan or anything, you say that you're pansexual, bisexual, lesbian, gay, transgender, anything. Delete anything in your bio about sex, because it could really damage if you if three if they read your bio. Now the other thing that I recommend doing is because they're going to be sabotaging any LGBTQ servers and games. So if you have an LGBTQ server, take it down. You should take it down immediately. Well, my, tell everyone on your server that you're taking it down. And before doing the first, you need to take down the server. Maybe make the server invisible something like that if you see any homopho if you see anyone in prideful on your discord talking to you on twitter block them immediately now if you see them posting any homophobic content ignore it they only want you to do what they want you to they're trying to make your mind slave don't fall for their tricks everything they say is a lie now what i also would recommend is if you're LGBTQ, and you know that you live in an area where there's going to be lots of those people, I don't recommend going outside that much. And if you are going outside, you know, if you're gay, lesbian, just don't make it clear that you're LGBTQ. They could kidnap you, see you physically, and do a lot of bad things. Now, I'm not done with this. All they want is to stop. LGBTQ. Now, what you should do is, I might start a Google campaign, or GoFundMe or something, that would stop these people on the internet, block them from the internet permanently. And if they would just fall in for their tricks, stop them, maybe get them to a therapist, get them to a therapist or something. And we need to help them. We need to save those people. Help. This is a serious time. Yeah. Now, you must be wondering, why would so many people do this? Let me tell you. They're dickheads. They don't have anything in their head apart from shit. They just shit in our youth. Yeah. We've had COVID-19. We've had this. And we've had Donald Trump. Sorry to anyone who likes Donald Trump. He probably didn't really go on America's Got Talent. Okay. Well, I've got nothing else to talk about. So, protect yourself. And try to make your year a little bit less shitty. Like, maybe get yourself a present. Bye.